ready? You ready? All right, so here we go with round one, and fear is not a factor for him. He feels so confident in all of his skills. He don't care what John. What do you got? John, what it doesn't matter. John, it doesn't matter. It does not matter how well you see yourself as a grappler. This guy's diff different level. Yeah. This guy's next level. You want to avoid this at all costs. Maintain this. But do not go and grapple this guy. Oh! Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night at that landed. Beautiful kick. Nice high kick. Oh, nice right hand. Both guys throwing potential fight enders here in the early going. Really timing his shots nicely. Good tempo, very accurate, finding the range with relative ease. Yeah, he's doing a great job of really overwhelming his opponent with activity. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one up? Still unable to find that precise range with the high kick. How about that shin? Oh, now he stuns him beautifully with the left hand. The left hand is so accurate. He's so educated. He's so able to fight from both fighting stances. Nice punch lands over the top. Slips to avoid the right. Strong defense there to block the shot. Nice instincts. Over and over, he's landing big body kicks. And under three minutes now to go on the round. Big powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Drive his shin into his own spot with that body kick. Oh! Look at him whip his hip into that kick. He is all about that left kick to the body. Kick to the outside of the lead leg there, DC. He is chopping up that leg. They say chop down the tree. You beat your opponent by slowing him down first with those nice outside legs. All right, so the taller fighter lands a knee, and Daniel Cormier to my right. I can hear him saying, I wish I was a little bit taller. Trying to double up on that jab. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. And both guys really throwing with authority. Well, he continues to offer up the kick here, but just misses with that one. seconds to go in round one. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You gotta like what you're seeing thus far. I mean, the speed at which he throws is crazy. 
Nice body shot there. Good series of strikes by him there. Great job of mixing it up, staying active, keeping busy, doing great work. Round two is next. All right, so a huge round for him there. That head kick probably would have had me out for good. And I survives to see another round. Yeah, but he'll go back to that. It landed so perfectly. He set it up great. He did a great job of mixing up the target early, going up high, and getting the desired result. Second round here. Big kick land. Oh, left hook to the head, it's blocked. Lee gets absolutely pelted by that head kick. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Just missing on the high kick there. Oh, and he connects there. Pretty nice punch there. Great job finding the range to land those punches. It's a beautiful, fast, quick jab with meaning. Can't take many of those. You better check. They continue to exchange. Doesn't take much for the redness to start. Look at the left side of his body there. Nasty. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes up. Big punch land. I mean, he's cutting down the side with these beautiful leg kicks. Connects with a right. Outstanding kick there by Lee. Looking to set up a knee of his own. Strong defense there to block the shot. It's okay, keep going, keep going. Oh, looking to land the leg kick, but unable to find the target. Beautiful strike. Well, he's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to mix it up a little bit more and just throw more volume. Because they don't see too much of a threat. This guy has to have confidence in knowing that when he extends his combinations, he's still safe, but he's also going to be able to land. He's got to be finding that confidence in his mind that all the reps in the training room are going to pay off. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. He's, he's lifting them. Lee going for the head kick. No dice. Well, a really good second round for him thus far after a somewhat lackluster first round. He has found the rhythm and found his striking range. Scary proposition for the opponent now here in round two. Punch coming. It's blocked. Relativities there. That right hand hurt him a little bit. Nice job moving off the center line. He slips to avoid that right hand. Left right combo is good. Well, as my favorite rap group Onyx would say, stick and move, right? Huh. Beautiful slip off the center line there. Yeah, what a great job of moving his head. It doesn't take much to avoid a punch. Ooh, what a punch. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Efficient with that jab. Doubles up on it now. Oh, it's a beautiful kick right there. I don't know if you've ever been kicked by a mule. Probably feel something like that. It has to. This guy is landing his kick with so much force. Lee going for the head kick. He misses there. Oh, and he lands yet another strike to the body. Pinpoint placement right underneath the elbow. Powerful leg kick lands. 
Well, a case of pick your poison here. Whoa! What a fantastic strike to throw at. Wow! Back to the feet. Oh, and he lands yet another knee. And sometimes it pays to be the taller fighter, DC. I know you can't necessarily relate. 15 seconds. Punch over the top. Big lift kick lands under the elbow. All right, that's the end of round number two. All right, so a huge round for him there. Nearly had him out of there with the head kick. Did get the knockdown. Talk us through the replay. He got the knockdown. He won the round. He did everything correct. The only thing he didn't do is finish the fight. But if he continues down the path, if he continues to do the exact same thing as he did before, he will get that finish. You ready? You ready? So Third round fight. underway. Well, he continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like he did in the previous round. This is a world-class display of striking here tonight. Look at the whip action. That's a huge strike. Lands there. Somehow, his opponent stayed upright. I mean, he's still on his feet, but he's not up by much. Good punch, Lance. It's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Just misses there with the left. Set it up a little bit better this time, okay? Here's that footwork. Oh, misses with the jab. Lance with the right hand. Oh, wicked nice leg kick there, DC. Can't take too many of those. Nice punch, Lance, over the top. And he landed the right hand there. Sniff that one out as he blocks the kick. Oh, man, this guy kicks like a mule. So hard. He kicks so hard every time you can see him drive his chin into his opponent. Oh, that's the quick score. How's his opponent still stand? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's going to be over very soon. And he continues to work the body here. Just missed with the leg kick. He loaded up there on that high kick. Just misses with the jet. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You like this guy. I like this guy a ton. And to watch him punch like this puts a smile on my face. Well, some fighters, when they get cracked in the mouth, they respond well. He got stunned earlier in the round and hasn't really recovered or gotten back into things. People react differently, right? Some people just get back going. He's having a hard time building his way back into this fight. Some nice back and forth action here. Well placed kick there by Lee. Oh, he's really starting to apply pressure on his opponent here. Different approach here in the last couple rounds. And it's the exact sense of urgency that you want to see from a fighter. Take the judges out. Whoa! Unbelievable! Oh! oh my goodness, what a fight. Again, the winner here was so aggressive with his onslaught that ultimately appeared as though the outcome was an eventuality. So if you're the referee, you got to protect the fighter. And I thought he did a good job of doing just that.
So a seminal moment.